translate points tool. This allows you to translate and move around the points that you had selected. So without any points selected right now, I can go in, select one, and drag and move that point around to distort the shape. So I can do that. Um, or I can go in and I've created a group with the select points tool. So I just created the left half of the star and now I can edit all those points. But you could use the select points tool to also go in and, and select different points. If I click on a shape, it'll select the whole shape so I can move this shape around. This is handy for placement or uh, animation. So down in the timeline here, if I move from from frame 0 to frame 12, just as a quick example, and move this shape across the screen and just scrub through the timeline, you'll see I created a quick animation there of it moving across the screen. So th this works for for all the points. So if I go in and edit the star as well, you'll see that that grows over or shrinks over time as well. So that's a way to translate the points on a layer to either reshape an object that you have, m morph an object you have, and animate it. That's the basics of the Translate Points tool.